are you doing did you miss me did you i missed you too so today we are going to be making a hair bonnet very easy we are going to be using needle and thread so let's just go to the video so the first thing that you need is some fabric um needle and thread there goes my needle and scissors and i'll later bring on my elastic band so let's go to the procedure on a normality this one fabric cannot be enough to make a big bonnet you see because you have to fold it half then quarter and then cut this to make it as like a circle but this is not enough so what i do is i take these ones so basics this is the wrong side the right side okay so what i'll do is i'll connect this wrong side to this wrong side this is the right side so i'll just make sure the wrong sides are outside they should be the ones that are visible so i connect two equal pieces like that and then i'll seal a line just across that so let me sew it and then i'll be right back finished you can see and so what i'll do i'll just put it this way so i know some of you will ask me what was the essence of doing this sewing these two pieces together it was to make one big fabric which will now make a big bonnet so i'll just flip it the other side just to have pleated and you see this into a quarter piece okay let's go to a flat surface so i folded this fabric two times one and two twice now i want to make it like to cut a circle like shape here so that when i open it up it will be a circle okay let me just demonstrate so that you can see it properly When I open it up, it's like a circle, you see. So on the right side, you can see. Okay, I never know it was hand which saw these two pieces together. So next, I will sew like this, just like an inch. Because of the elastic band I'm going to use. And I'll just sew doing this all the way till I sew the whole circumference of this fabric. So let's start. I have some drop of 
friends so next I'll pass through the elastic band here and make it go around the whole circumference and come out through here so let's do that so this is my elastic band yeah so before I put it around the circumference I should measure it out in my head standard measurements here that will fit me well so I'll take my scissors and just chop so I don't have a bobby pin no I don't have the normal pin so I'll use this one Let me yeah just like that it will be easier to go through on this so it's just as easy as this and when it enters take your needle and uh, you see this last point this one just here Secure it. Let me secure and show you. Just like that. You can see where I have secured it. So that even if I go around, this piece won't follow me. And it will just be there. So let me do this. So you can see why I pinned that down. So I can just unpin it, pull it, remove this and sew these two together. So this is the final outcome. Just like this. You see how it's looking? It's a very big bonnet. So the line I had connected the two fabrics is here. But even on a normality, you cannot notice. The ozone had made earlier. This one. This is a larger version of this, you can see. Yeah, so this is the bigger version with a small one, but still. It's still huge. So that was what I was showing you. This one is for a client. And uh, this one is mine. And just see how big it is. You can use it when your hair is up like that. And when you remove it. So that's that for today's video. Bye. Oh, make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video. Bye. See you next time.